In this lecture, we're going to create an Apple TV app within the iTunes Connect. So first of all, go to any of your web browsers, I'm going to use Safari here, and go to itunesconnect.apple.com. Press Enter, and here, log in with one of your Apple ID, the, the one that you use for your Apple developer license. Once you're logged in, you're going to see a plus sign under My Apps. So make sure you click on My Apps. And by the way, um, if you see any yellow warnings here or anything that says uh, agree to the terms of services and things like that, you got to do this now. Otherwise, you're not going to be able to submit your app to the iTunes App Store. So you better input your data and, and sign every contract. Click on My Apps and you will see on the top left a plus sign. So click here and now click on New App. As soon as you do this, let it load a little bit. Make sure you target TV OS. All right, that's the difference. If you target iOS, this will be for iPhones and iPads. If you target TV OS, this will be for the Apple TV. Now I'll give it a name. So I'm going to call this one um, Tic Tac Toe Apple TV. I'm um, sorry, Tic Tac Toe on TV. All right. And primary language, I'm going to choose English. And the bundle ID. I'm going to use the Team Wildcard. Now, make sure you use the bundle ID that you created in your app. So, let me show you exactly what I'm talking about. Go back to your Xcode and look at the ID that you have not here, not under your, your, main, your main target. You got to go to the Tic Tac Toe Apple TV target and look in the Info tab. All right, and here the bundle identifier is the one that you're going to connect. So I'm going to call mine com.appfresh.tictactoe.tv. All right, and I'm going to copy this. And now I'm going to paste this. I'm going to paste this within Safari right here. All right, so that would be tictactoe.tv. Now I'm using a wildcard, so yours might be just on one lane, on one line, and your final bundle ID is shown here. All right, so I'm going to copy this and paste it under my SKU number, which is the unique number for products, and click create. Now once you've done this, go back to Xcode, Xcode and make sure that you have the right one here. So paste it again or press enter. All right, there we go. Once you've done with that, now this is it. We have the tic tac toe on TV app that's created for us. And we're going to have in the next lecture to enter all the data here. But there we go, we have added our TV app within the iTunes Connect dashboard. See you guys in the next lecture.